What's up guys, Coach Madden, official trainer, YouGoProBaseball.com, and today we've got Will Nieves, 12 season MLB catcher. Line to left field, that's got a lot of carry, it is gone! A grand slam! New pitch, out toward right center field, that's pretty well hit. Hayward on the run, he's not going to get there, it's going to go over the wall in one hop. A ground rule double for Nieves. Here's the pitch. He swings, throws one to right field. It's a bases clearing double for Will Nieves. He's got a great drill for us that is going to help fix two of the most common problems in swings. I, I was going to say youth baseball swings, but really swings at any level. Can you first tell us what these two issues are? Yeah, I, I mean, I, I think one of the biggest issues that I see kids and, and, and just all over uh, is, is guys drifting forward so they're they're hitting on their front foot or or they're flying open they're flying open right so they're coming around the ball from shoulder hip everything flies open i got the blessing of uh playing with tony win back in the day with the padres and a drill that he, he teach me uh it was every time you know that i want to fix my drifting or the flying open i will put the tee on the outside corner and I will put it farthest back I could, right there. So if you see me, like it's kind of the middle of my body, maybe a little bit more on the back side. And if I want to be able to hit that ball hard the other way, there's no way that I can go forward. If I go forward, I cannot hit it. Or if I open up, I'm not going to be able to hit it. I had to load, I had to create separation, to create separation, load, and now I got to stay back here and explode that way. That's awesome, Will. Let me ask you a question. When, how often would you do these? Would you only do this when you were struggling or would you do this um, when, you're, when your swing is doing good? Um, and are there any other drills that you could do to work on those, fixing those two things? I did this all the time. You know, I'm, if I was having problem, I did it a little bit more. If I was good with my swing, I did it just to keep that 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 muscle memory right and, and and just keep that drill in my mind that's one of the biggest problems kids do something and, and even in the big leagues they do something that it take them out of the slump and when they come out of the slump they stop you know what happened they go back in the slump is there any other drills hitting drills that you did in your routine to when you were working on the flying open or drifting yeah mentally mentally if 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 you're flying open right and I told you to close yourself a little bit more, you know what you're gonna end up doing? Flying even more, flying open even more. So, so what I told the kids, you know, and, 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 and what I did, I was the kind of guy that if I start my swing like this, like, I don't know why, I will, I will open up and, and go around and fly open. So mentally, if I start open, just a little bit open, if I start just a little open, in my mind, I'm like, I'm already open. Where am I gonna, where am I gonna go? I had to close myself to hit it. So like that, you work with your mind the opposite. There's a couple of drills that I used to do. There was one drill that I put the ball there, put the ball, just stay like this, and just make sure my upper, gut, my upper body goes in, and I just use my hands going forward. Another one, it was there. I will be here, then I will turn. You see, like, I'm open already. There's no way that I can open even more because where am I gonna go? I have to go get that ball. You should be able to hit that ball the other way. If you're not, you're going around the ball. You're not throwing the knob to the inside part. That's what I tell the guys. Throw that knob to the inside part of the ball, literally. Try to hit that ball with the outside, with, with the inside part of the, uh, of the of the knob. You always want to hit the ball middle, middle, the other way. Pulling is easy. Pulling it should come natural. That's awesome, Will. That's great explanation, guys. For those of you watching, there's three things that stood out to me that Will said that I really want you to take from this video. Number one is that you have to do this. Like if if you're working on your swing and you do it once or twice and then you stop. What's the point? You have to stay committed. You have to have a routine, routine. Have your routine. Don't have Will's routine. Have what works for you and do it on a consistent basis. Consistency is key. And the third thing that I really want you guys to take away from this is work on hitting the ball 
the opposite field. All these drills Will was working on hitting the ball opposite field. If you like this one, please give us a thumb up, thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Go check out Will on Facebook and Instagram at Will Nieves Academy. Okay, I'll leave his information down below as well as his, as his email if you guys are in the Orlando, Florida and want some great hitting and catching instruction. He's going to be available, so hit him up on the email and we'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks, Will. Thank you.